This video will teach you how to change direction without sinking, also known as a transition. You should first be at a stage where you can easily stop and ride off again within a few seconds. When you want to transition, you must first slow down a little. If you lose most of your momentum, it will be easier to change direction. Once you are riding at a slower speed, you next have to switch your board. Slide your board from left foot leading to right foot leading. Keep your toes up as you slide so the edge of the board does not catch. Your right foot should now be leading and pointing completely downwind. You are now ready to turn. Steer the kite over to the right hand side. Follow the kite downwind and then to the right. Wait a while before trying to go upwind. The first few times you transition, redirect the kite slowly. If you sink, gradually steer the kite more aggressively. The key points to remember are, one, slow down, two, switch your stance, three, redirect and follow the kite. Now we'll look at a transition from riding right to riding left. Just like before, we start by slowing down to lose some momentum. Once you've slowed down, switch your feet to left foot leading and riding downwind. Swing the kite over to the left and follow it with your left foot. Here are a few common mistakes made when first learning transitions. A very common mistake is to try to turn without first losing enough momentum. If you have too much momentum, you will swing into the air, which can be quite amusing. If you manage to change direction, but sink shortly after, you are probably a little timid moving the kite. You should steer the kite more firmly or simply move the kite up and down after turning for an extra power dive. If your board catches like this, it means you haven't switched stance completely. You must swap your stance well before moving the kite and you must also transfer your weight onto your new back leg. Good luck learning transitions.